me Blippi. And look at what's behind me. Whoa. This is a snowmobile. And this snowmobile belongs to my friends, Magnus and Hans. <laughs> and today, you and I are gonna learn about snowmobiles. Yeah! Got to ask you, what colors do you see on the snowmobile? Yeah, I see the color red, black, white, and hey, look down here. There's some silver. <laughs> hey, come back here. Wow, look at this tree. What color is this tree? Looks like icy green and brown. And what else? Yeah, the snow is white. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I love playing in the snow, <laughs> but it's so cold. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah! Yeah! This snowmobile is so powerful. Do you know how the snowmobile gets all of its power? Yeah, the engine. Whoa, check that out. Looks like we have, oh, this looks like maybe the engine oil. Whoa, that's what helps cool the engine. Um, let's see. Ooh, looks like the flywheel, some gears. Oh. And look at this. This is a front shock. Yeah, this is part of the suspension of the snowmobile. Whoa, and look down here. This snowmobile has two skis. One right here and one over there. Whoa, that is what's on the front to help steer the snowmobile. Come on up to the other side. Whoa, the other engine compartment. Whoa, looks like we have the exhaust in there. You definitely don't want to touch that. That is really hot. Oh, and we have the intake, and we have the engine way down in there. Whoa, this engine is so compact with so much power, all in the front of the snowmobile. Come to the back, check this out. Wow, this is the track of the snowmobile. You see these big things poking up? Whoa. That helps it grip into the snow so it doesn't slip and slide. Yeah, that's kind of like the tread on a wheel and tire. But this snowmobile does not have a wheel or a tire. <laughs> oh, come check this out. All right, this is the dash of the snowmobile right here. This is where it tells you how fast you're going, your engine temperature. Oh, and look at right here. Yeah, the key. Yeah, you know what that does. When you have that in, then you turn it 
and that is how you start the snowmobile. But it's not like a car where you just start it with a key. You have to pull this. Check this out. Yeah! Here, come here. So for safety, we have the brake and not for safety, we have the throttle. Here we go. This has been so much fun riding this snowmobile. Oh geez, I sure do love the seasons, don't you? Yeah, it's so cool how you can do fun things during the spring and the summer and the fall and the winter. Yeah, let's go. Look at what we found! Yeah, we found a river! Whoa! This has been so much fun exploring with the snowmobiles and finding this river. Hey, do you know what animals live in this river? Yeah, probably some fish! Whoa! I definitely don't want to be a fish right now and swim in that water. That water looks so cold! <laughs> Check out this yellow vehicle! Whoa! Do you see something unique about it? Yeah, check this out! Just like how the snowmobile has tracks, yeah, it doesn't have wheels and tires. Yeah, the Jeep also has tracks! It doesn't have wheels and tires as well, just like the snowmobile. Snowmobiling at Leavenworth Snowmobile Tours at the Mountain Springs Lodge in Plain, Washington. Ho, ho, ho. Do you like snowmobiling? Yeah, I do too. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B L I P P I. Flippy. Good job. Bye-bye!
That's me, Blippi. <laughs> and me, Mika. <laughs> and today, we're here at Mr. Bones Pumpkin Patch. In Culver City, California. <laughs> yeah, and then, <laughs> wait a minute. Mika, yeah. have you ever been to a pumpkin patch before? <gasps> yeah, I love pumpkin patches. <laughs> oh, me too. Yeah, and Mr. Bones Pumpkin Patch is so fun. There are a lot of pumpkins and fun things to do, like a bounce house and a maze. <gasps> I'm just so excited, I think we should go. <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Flippy, look at this! Whoa, look! It's a bounce house! <laughs> a spider bounce house! <laughs> well, it is almost Halloween, so I think that's why they have a spooky spider on top. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Yeah? There's a spider on top of the bounce house. Mm -hmm. Mika, do you know how many legs a spider has? Oh, yeah! Eight legs! Whoa! Hey, <laughs> will you count the spider's legs with us? Okay, Great. here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. <laughs> eight. <Whoa. laughs> well, I can't wait to start bouncing. <laughs> I'm so excited to bounce. Whoa. Hey, maybe we could do a spider dance in the bounce house. Oh, yes. We could pretend to be trapped in its web. Whoa, let's Whoa. go. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, after you. <laughs> Thanks, friend. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. I'm stuck. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Spider crawling along. Whoa! <laughs> Woo! Where'd Mika go? Huh? You see her anywhere? Ah! There she is! <laughs> <laughs> hey, where did Blippi go? Have you seen my best friend? Over there? Where? Hey! I'm gonna go around. Blippi? Blippi, where are you? That way? Spider dance. Woo. Spider dance. Spider dance. <laughs> Whoa. 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 I'm pretty dizzy after all that <laughs> spidering around. Whoa. Hello. Whoa. That was so fun. Whoa. Hey, Blippi, check it out. Whoa. I'm another right, yeah. bounce house. Come on. Whoa, Whoa. Mika, look. It's another bounce house. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. I love bouncing with you, Bestie. Aw, <laughs> uh, thanks. I love bouncing with you, too. <laughs> and this bounce house is so, so big! Oh, it's spooky! <laughs> Woo. Woo. I have an idea. Yeah. How about you and I go down this bounce house at the same time? Because okay. there are two slides. Oh, we could go together. Yeah, look. One, two. Whoa! <laughs> okay, after you, no, best friend. After you, Blippi. After you, best no, friend. After you. Oh, okay. I'll go first. <laughs> oh, 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 here we go. It's so tall up here. Okay. Here we go. Let's race on the count of three. Three, two, one. Woo! Ah! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> that was so much fun. Whoa, Mika, you won. This calls for a 10 second dance party. Dance party. Woo! <laughs> Whoa, that was fun. Yeah. <laughs> well, we did race the first time, but I do think we could go down another time. Yeah, let's do it again. Okay, here we go. <laughs> okay, here we go. Bye. <laughs> Don't forget to brush your teeth. <laughs> hey, I'm going to go down that side this time. Okay. Ready? Get. Flippy, <laughs> where are you? Whoa. I can't see you. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, where'd he go? <laughs> there he is. Whoa. That was awesome. That was so fun. Well, I think we better keep exploring. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Whoa, I've been having so much fun today. <laughs> yeah, Mika and I are looking for the big pumpkin patch. <laughs> Isn't that right, Mika? Mika? Uh-oh, it looks like we lost Mika. <laughs> you see her anywhere? Mm, I don't see her anywhere. Uh, do you hear something? Oh, it sounds like a ghost. Oh, I hear it again. Oh, a big ghost. Oh, oh, it looks like... Oh, 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 
<laughs> it's Mika. Oh, hi, Mika. <laughs> hey, Wendy. <laughs> you scared me there. <laughs> hey, come check this out. Okay. <laughs> oh, let's go inside. <laughs> Whoa! Mika, what is this place? It's a hay maze. Yeah. Whoa! Hey! This is pretty amazing. Hey! <laughs> well, Mika, we've been looking for pumpkins. Do mm -hmm. you think there are some pumpkins here? I'm not sure, but it's pretty cool. <laughs> hey, let's play a game. Yeah, we can play a game while we're looking for pumpkins. Hmm, what should we play? Mm. Ooh, we <gasps> can play Simon Says. <laughs> oh, let's make it Mika and Blippi Says. Oh, I like that idea. <laughs> okay, uh, would you like to go first? Sure. Okay, here we go. Blippi and Mika Says. <laughs> Mika Says, ride around like a witch on a broomstick. Okay. <laughs> here we go. Oh, that's pretty fun. <laughs> okay, Blippi says, act like a mummy. Whoa, Mika, look. Hey, it's what's a tunnel. That? A Whoa. tunnel. Huh. I wonder where the tunnel goes. Me too. Mm. You should check it out. Well, yeah. Maybe there are pumpkins at the end of the tunnel. Great idea, Blippi. <laughs> I'll see you on the other side. Bye. Okay. Good luck finding pumpkins. Here we go. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> it's so dark in here. Let's play another Mika Says. Mika Says, float to the top of the haystack just like a ghost. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. So spooky. Hmm. <gasps> <gasps> Whoa! Hey, Mika! <laughs> Whoa! I didn't find any pumpkins. No? But I think it's my turn for Blippi Says. Go for it. Okay, Blippi Says, act like a bat. Woohoo! Woo -hoo -hoo. Flying is fun! Whoa, check us out! Whoa! <laughs> Woo! Okay, Blippi Says, stop! Stop! <laughs> now, act like a skeleton! <laughs> skeleton bones. Blippi didn't say! Oh, Blippi! <laughs> Mika, look at what it is! But these are kind of small pumpkins. Yeah, very mm, little. Yeah, and this, look, they're like little ovals. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa. But wait a minute. There's little patches of pumpkins. Maybe this leads to the big pumpkin patch. Yeah, let's follow these pumpkins. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Woo. Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, it looks like we're finding some more pumpkins. <laughs> but we're getting close to the pumpkin patch. Let's keep going. Okay. <laughs> oh, hey, look. There's some more here. <gasps> some medium sized ones. A big flat one, too. <laughs> hey, I bet the big pumpkin patch is just around the corner. <gasps> hmm. <gasps> Check it out. It's the pumpkin <laughs> village. <laughs> There are so many pumpkins here at the big pumpkin patch. Mm -hmm. Oh, Mika, maybe we can pick one out. <gasps> That's a great idea, Blippi. <laughs> but I think we better go in first. Okay. <laughs> here we go. <gasps> Check it out. <laughs> well, this place is amazing. Wow. And Mika, do you see what I see? A pumpkin house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a giant pumpkin. <laughs> we better go inside. Yeah. <laughs> woo, 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 woo. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Mika, it looks like a pumpkin you might carve out like a jack-o'-lantern. Yeah! <laughs> Whoa, it's so big! <laughs> I'll pretend to be a light inside. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think I want to pretend to be a seed. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! I'm a pumpkin seed! Whoa, check it out! <laughs> Whoa, it's Whoa. so bright! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pretty silly. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Pumpkin seeds are so tasty mm -hmm. because you can eat them. You can roast them, mm -hmm. toast them. Mm. <laughs> or you can just have them grow up to be a pumpkin. Yeah, if you give them water and light. Mm -hmm. I love pumpkins. <laughs> Me too. And pumpkin picking at a pumpkin patch is a really fun thing to do on Halloween. <laughs> yeah, you can mm. make jack-o'-lanterns. Well, Mika, I think there's some more pumpkins for us to see here. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there are so Whoa. many pumpkins 
here. <laughs> yeah, way too many pumpkins to carve. Yeah, too many to carve <laughs> and too many to eat. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm, but Mika, what should we do with all these pumpkins? <gasps> I know. Let's play a game. Oh, games are so fun. <laughs> so first, I'll need a pumpkin with a long stem. Mm. Oh, I think I can find that. I'll be right back. Thanks, Flippy. Mmm. What are you gonna be for Halloween? <laughs> Whoa! That's a great idea. Mika! Mika! Oh, I found one! He's back! Oh, here's the pumpkin! Oh, perfect! And look what I have! Rings! Colorful rings! Whoa! Wait, Mika! Yeah? Are we gonna do a ring toss? Oh, yeah! <laughs> okay, well, let's use the colorful rings mm -hmm. to do a ring toss and see how many points we can make. Yep. Yeah. Every ring is one point. One point a ring. Okay, I'm gonna go put down the pumpkin. How about right there? Okay. Ooh. Great! <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay. Mika, you can go first. Oh, thanks, Blippi. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Hold on, let me warm up my arm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> or, or you play <laughs> a game <laughs> or do something that takes a lot of movement. It's good to warm up. <laughs> All right, I'm ready. <laughs> Here I go. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Oh, no, so it's really close. close. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> uh oh, that's okay, Mika. <laughs> no worries. Whoa. Hi, guys. Whoa. <laughs> now I'm gonna try. Okay. You got it. Whoa, this is actually a lot harder than it looks, so I'm gonna see if I can get one ring on the pumpkin. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. <gasps> uh oh. Nice try, friend. <laughs> hmm. You got it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Whoa, check it out! We did it! We did it! That was really fun. Playing a ring toss. Good idea, Mika. Thanks, Al. Would you like to play another game? Oh, I would love to. Okay, follow me. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. 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 Hey, Blippi! Whoa. Check it out! Whoa. A game! Whoa, check it out! Here you go. Hockey sticks? Hmm. Ooh, but maybe these could be hmm, a toothbrush. Oh, or a long braid. <laughs> or a really big nose. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Or ooh, maybe really silly ears. Whoa. Whoa. I'll scratch you behind your ears. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's funny. Or a broomstick. <laughs> <laughs> well, so Mika, what game should we play? Hmm, how about <gasps> hockey? Soccer. Hockey, let's play hockey. <laughs> yeah. oh, and it looks like we have our hockey sticks uh -huh. and a, a net, yeah, mm -hmm. a goal. <laughs> but we need a hockey puck that <sighs> we can use to hit into the goal. <laughs> <laughs> I've got just the thing. Do, 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 abracadabra. A pumpkin puck. <laughs> Pumpkin puck? That would be great. <laughs> we don't have a regular pup, puck, but since it's Halloween, mm -hmm. this pumpkin puck will be perfect. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> okay, here we go. Time to play. Yeah. Ooh. Pass Ooh. it to me. Yeah. Ooh. 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 There you go. Ooh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm going for the goal. Go. Woo. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So wonderful when we played Mika and Blippi Says by the Mace. <laughs> and it was a lot of fun bouncing on the bouncy houses. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, but if you'd like to watch more of our videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with us? Okay, here we go. Ready? B L I P P I. Blippi. Good job. <laughs> can you spell my name with us? Great. M E E. K-A-H, Mika! <laughs> well, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye! Whoa! Ooh. <laughs> Here we go! <gasps> Giddy up! Giddy up! It's me, Flippy! <laughs>
and today we're here in the Centre du Secours in La Relais, France! <laughs> yeah, and it was raining outside, so I wanted to do something really fun indoors. That's why I'm here at this emergency service center! Yeah! This is where firefighters work. Yeah, in France, firefighters are called les pompiers. <laughs> yeah, they fight fires, but they also do all kinds of things. <laughs> and I wanted to know, what does it take to become a real firefighter here in France? <laughs> hmm, but first, let's go explore some emergency service vehicles. Come on! Whoa, check it out! Do you know what this is? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's right, it's a fire truck. <laughs> yeah, and in French, you say fire truck like this. Un camion de pompier. Whoa, that's pretty fun to say. And this fire truck is awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's so big and it has all kinds of things to help put out a fire. Like this. Whoa, this is the hose. Whoa, it's pretty cool. And the way you say hose in French is just like this. Un tuyau. <laughs> whoa, and look, it's so big so that the water, whoa, can go through the hose, whoa, to put out the fire. <laughs> and this one is really, really long, see? <laughs> but I think this side goes on fire hydrant. <laughs> whoa, and do you see what I see? One of the most important things, yeah. This is really important, a ladder, <laughs> yeah. A ladder in French is une échelle. <laughs> yeah, ladders are so important so that the firefighters can climb up to really tall buildings and use the hose to put out the fire. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. There's a really big door. Hmm. Wonder what's behind it. Whoa, check it out. It's a water pump, the pump puts a lot of pressure on the water so that it can go through the hose and onto the fire. <laughs> Whoa, this is a pretty amazing fire truck. It has hoses, ladders, and a really awesome water pump. <laughs> yeah! Whoa, this fire truck is awesome! <laughs> yeah, it's so much fun to explore it. But remember, always ask permission before you touch something that doesn't belong to you. Good thing I have permission to touch the fire truck. Woohoo! <laughs> and check out all the things on it. Like, whoa, this safety cone. Woo, woo, woo. <laughs> yeah, it's one of my two favorite colors, orange. And it also is really shiny, so you see it. Yeah, if you see a safety cone, it means they're doing something really important. You don't want to get too close, because it might not be safe. Oh, <laughs> but it sure is pretty to look at. <laughs> yeah, and do you see what else? There's all kinds of tools, different types of equipment that a firefighter might need to help people. <laughs> oh, and look at what it is. Whoa, this fire truck has really big wheels and tires. Yeah, really big treads to grip the ground so it can get really fast to wherever it needs to go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, and look, it has so many different bolts all around it, so it's nice and secure. <laughs> hey, and you see what this is? Look, whoa, <laughs> this right here is another fire hose, but this one's a little bit different. Mm, yeah, it's really brightly colored, and <laughs> whoa, whoa, you can pick it up. Yeah, you can pick up this hose because yeah, this hose is meant for indoors. It means you can carry it inside a building, put out the fire that's inside. Yeah, oh, and see, it's a little bit smaller too. <laughs> Wait a minute, I have an idea. Let's dance and do the firefighter hose dance. Woohoo! come on. <laughs> Woo. Firefighters are awesome. Yeah, they put out all kinds of fires, even forest fires and wildfires. <laughs> yeah, 
That's when they use this fire truck here. Whoa, it's huge. Check it out. <laughs> you see these wheels and tires? Yeah, this is called the CCFM fire truck. Woohoo! And these big tires help to grip the mud or the grass or drive over trees that you might find on a forest floor. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, and you see this over here? Whoa. <laughs> yeah, it's a really big bumper. Woohoo! So if it bumps into a tree or a really big plant, Keeps on going. Doesn't stop these firefighters. <laughs> yeah, they need to stop the fire. Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa, and did you notice something? The back of the fire truck is huge. <laughs> Whoa, yeah, it's really, really big. That's because it's filled up with water. <laughs> if you're putting out a wildfire out in the forest or on a grassy area, it's not near the city, so there aren't fire hydrants. Yeah, you need to bring all the water you'll need Put out the fire. <laughs> That's pretty silly. <laughs> hey, you know that firefighters do other things too? They can even help when there's a flood. Whoa, check this out. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, check it out. This isn't a fire truck, but it helps with floods. Yeah. It's a really big engine and a really big pump. Yeah, this pump here pumps all the water out of a flooded area and takes it to the drain in the city. <laughs> Firefighters are so cool. <laughs> yeah, oh, it would be so cool to be a pompier. Woo Whoa, I'm having so much fun today learning all about les pompiers and emergency vehicles, but I would really like to meet a firefighter. That would be so fun. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you see there's a person? Oh, I bet they're a pompier. Let's go say hi. Come on. Oh, hi, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Hi, Blippi. I'm Kum. Oh, it's so nice to meet you, Kum. Oh, are you? A pompier? Yes. Whoa, yeah, I noticed your shirt and your jacket. <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> but what's the first thing you need to do to become a firefighter? You have to take some tests. Whoa, <laughs> that sounds a little bit tricky, but because pompiers are so strong and smart, <laughs> I bet it wasn't too hard. <laughs> oh, well, after you become a pompier, what do you do next? You have to dress like a pompier. Whoa, <laughs> that sounds like a lot of fun. <laughs> you think I could dress up just like a pompier? Yes, of course. Whoa, that would be fun. <laughs> and I think I'm ready. <laughs> On y va? That means let's go. Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa, Colm, what's this? This is what we wear. Whoa, check it out. <laughs> Actual pompier pants and a jacket. Whoa, so colorful. <laughs> oh, how do you say these things in French? Une veste. Ooh, and a pantalon. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Do you think I can try them on? Yes, of course. Okay, let's do it. Well, which one do I do first? The pants. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> okay. Whew. Whoa. Look, they even have suspenders. <laughs> That's pretty fun. Okay. One leg. Here we go. And Ooh. two legs. Woo. <laughs> oh. And now. The suspenders, <laughs> double suspenders, woo! <laughs> okay, now time to put on the jacket. Okay, here we go. <gasps> Whoa, this is awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty heavy and probably really helpful to protect you, right? Yes. <laughs> well, what do I have to put on next? Up here. Whoa, check it out. Look at this helmet. Whoa, <laughs> what's this called? On casque. Whoa, on cask. <laughs> well, I like the sound of that. <laughs> well, can I try it on? Of course. Whoa. Well, this is gonna be fun to try on, but whew, it looks like there's also a hood. Yeah, because firefighters go into really warm places and need to wear this hood to protect them. But I'm not a real firefighter, so I'm just gonna try this on. <laughs> okay, here we go. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> Feel like a real pompier now. <laughs> well, I think I'm all done, right? No. Oh, am I forgetting something? Your gloves. 
Oh, my gloves. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, check it out. Two gloves. Yeah. One, two. <laughs> Whoa, that's pretty cool. <laughs> and what are these called in French? Dingo. Whoa. <laughs> okay, time to put them on. Here we go. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. I'm all dressed just like a pompier. <laughs> yeah, I have on my pants. Pantalon, my jacket, vest, my helmet, my casque, and my gloves. Bingo. Whoa, that was so much fun getting dressed up just like a firefighter and learning some French. <laughs> but after you take a test and then dress up, what do you have to do next? You can train yourself. Oh, that sounds like a lot of fun. <laughs> you think I could try some training? Yes, of course. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Follow me. <laughs> Whoa, check it out! We're here on the basket of the fire truck! <laughs> what we do in training is ride the basket. Oh yeah, you definitely want to ride the basket. It's what firefighters use to reach really high buildings. <laughs> yeah, but they have a hose. Since we're practicing, I don't have a hose yet. <laughs> okay, I think I'm ready to go up! <laughs> Are you ready, BP? I'm ready! <laughs> up. Here we go! Woohoo! <laughs> I had so much fun today. <laughs> Thank you so much, Comb, for teaching me all about being a firefighter. Thank you, Blippi. Mm. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. It was a pleasure. <laughs> see you soon. See you soon. Whoa, today was awesome. <laughs> yeah, we learned all about emergency vehicles and what it takes to become a pompier. Woohoo! <laughs> Well, that's the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, ready? <laughs> Here we go. B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Here we go. It's me, Blippi! And can you guess where I am today? <laughs> yeah! That's right, we're here in Diggerland in Kent, England! <laughs> Whoa, and do you see what I'm riding in? Yeah, this right here is a telehandler. <laughs> yeah, they're really big vehicles that lift really big, heavy things. <laughs> but today, it's not lifting a big, heavy thing, it's lifting me! <laughs> Whoa, here we go! Whoa! Diggerland is awesome! And I wonder what kind of construction vehicles we'll see today. <laughs> Wait a minute, do you hear something? Hmm, I think I hear a vehicle. Do you see a construction vehicle behind me? <laughs> Whoa, check it out! It's an excavator! <laughs> yeah! Well, I love excavators. <laughs> oh, I have an idea. Let's pretend to be excavators and dig in the dirt together. <laughs> Okay, I'll teach you how. Just bring up your arm to be the arm, the boom, and the bucket, and start to scoop. <laughs> Whoa, look at a scoop! Whoa, that was so much dirt! <laughs> Good job. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. I think I see someone in the cab. Maybe they can teach us how to operate the excavator. <laughs> Let's take a closer look. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, it's so muddy here. Good thing I brought my rain boots. <laughs> oh, hey, there's a person. Come on, let's go say hi. <laughs> okay. Hello. Hi. Hi, I'm Blippi, what's your name? My name's Brad. Oh, Brad, it's nice to meet you. <gasps> Can you teach us how to operate the excavator? Of course I can. Okay, <laughs> cool. <laughs> so, Brad, can I climb up in there? Yes. Okay, Careful. here we go. <laughs> Let's get into the cab. 
So, seatbelt first for me. Oh yeah, safety first. That stick over there, mm -hmm. I want you to pull it backwards for me and that's gonna go all the way up. Okay, here we go. If you push it forwards for me, it should go all the way down for you. Now, if you go side to side on that one, it's gonna open and close your bucket for you to do big scoops. Whoa, check it out! Now, on this one here, if you go forwards and backwards for me, that's gonna go in and out. Okay. Whoa! So this is controlling the arm. Yes. Whoa. And then the last bit, if you go side to side on it, that will turn the whole thing for you. Okay, here we go. Watch awesome. out. Watch <laughs> out. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Check it out! Whoa! Yeah! I can control the arm right here and the boom over here. Here we go. Woo! <laughs> Whoa, this is awesome! <laughs> Whoa, let's scoop some more dirt. Here we go. Whoa, look at all the dirt we got. Here we go. Did you see that? Whoa, excavators are awesome! <laughs> so much fun learning how to operate the excavator. Huh, but excavators are really cool, but I bet there's some pretty amazing construction vehicles we can go find. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, this place is so much fun. <laughs> Whoa, and do you see what it says? It says, stack attack. Hmm, wait a minute, I think this is a game. We can play together. Well, let's go inside and play. This place is awesome. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Yeah, so muddy and dirty here. <laughs> I bet this game is definitely gonna be messy. <laughs> Whoa, and look at what it is. <laughs> They're giant tires! Woo! <laughs> Whoa, look at all the tires here. It looks like there are one, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> six tires. Hmm, well, I bet the game is we need to stack all the tires up. Stack, attack, stack the tires. Okay, we can do it. Okay, we just need to get a tire and stack it on another and we can make a tower of tires. <laughs> okay, here we go. <gasps> Whoa, <laughs> that tire is way too heavy to pick up. Hmm, but I wonder how we're going to stack all of those tires. No way! <laughs> Look at what it is! It's a compact loader! Whoa! This is gonna be perfect for stacking those tires. Yeah, do you see in the front? This is a hydraulic claw! Yeah, look at it. Whoa! <laughs> and it uses these little claws here to grab the tires and stack them up. <laughs> Whoa! I think we should get inside <laughs> and try to stack up those tires. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> this is pretty fun. <laughs> hey, it's kind of like any other vehicle. Safety first. You need your seatbelt. <laughs> okay, we'll buckle up. And hmm, well, we also need to know how to drive it. So first, we have pedals. One pedal goes forward, and the other pedal, it goes backwards. <laughs> it has a key, just like a car, so we can turn it on and a steering wheel, <laughs> so we can change direction. Ooh, and do you see what this is? Yeah, this right here, this is the control for the hydraulic claw. Yeah, when we move this, it will move the claw so we can stack up those tires and have lots of fun and win the game. <laughs> okay, I think it's time to stack those tires. <laughs> here we go. 
Woo! <laughs> Look at it go! <laughs> Okay, here we go. One tire! <laughs> okay. Whee! We stacked three tires, but we need to stack the rest. <laughs> We stacked all six tires, but they fell over. <laughs> that was pretty fun and a little bit silly. <laughs> Come on, let's go! <laughs> Woo! Hello! <laughs> Check it out! <laughs> Do you know what I was just driving? <laughs> yeah, that is a backhoe. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bumpy to drive, but so fun. And I thought we could go on a ride together. But first, I wanted to show you this. <laughs> yeah, do you know what this is called? It's called the front bucket. Yeah, and on a backhoe, it helps to dig up all the dirt <laughs> so you can make a really big hole and help to build something if you're on a construction site. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. A backhoe has really big wheels and tires. <laughs> yeah, look, it has medium sized front wheels and tires <laughs> and really, really, really big <laughs> back wheels and tires. <laughs> it's a little bit muddy. <laughs> yeah, look, big treads help to get all the mud so it can go really fast <laughs> and so that it doesn't get stuck. <laughs> Whoa, and do you see what this is? Hmm, <laughs> yeah, it's an excavator arm. Whoa. Wait a minute, a backhoe like this has an excavator arm attachment, just like the Blippi Mobile has an excavator arm attachment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it has an arm, a boom, and a bucket, so it can dig all the dirt in the back, or the front bucket can dig in the front. Well, that was really cool showing you the exterior of the backhoe. Now, it's time to get inside and go for a ride. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Ooh, here we go. <laughs> Watch your step. Whoa, I am so excited to go on a ride with you. But first things first, you need to buckle your seatbelt. <laughs> and I'm gonna buckle up too. <laughs> Safety first. <sighs> okay, and now we get to start the backhoe and Kind of like a car, it has a key right over here. <laughs> okay, here we go. Whoa, yeah, check it out. We're inside the backhoe. It has a wheel just like a car and look, oh, <laughs> a windshield wiper. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> okay, but it's not raining right now, so we don't need that. And it has a gear shifter, so we'll put that into the right gear and take the brake away. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're all ready to drive. <laughs> oh, but I forgot another important thing. Yeah, if we want to move the front bucket, we just move this knob right over here. Here we go. Check it out. Whoa, up, down, up. <laughs> okay, I think we're ready to drive. Here we go. Woo! Do you see what it is? Yeah, there's a bunch of tires. Maybe we can try to pick one up. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Whoa, do you see it? Look, we grabbed a tire with the front bucket. And I have an idea. <laughs> Let's take it with us on our journey. Woo, here we go. Whoa, <laughs> that was a big bump. 
Yeah. <laughs> but it's so fun driving in a backhoe because the tires and treads are so big that even if we drive over a couple bumps, it's okay. <laughs> yeah, can't hurt us. <laughs> Here we go. We're gonna make a big turn. Whoa! And through a big puddle. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh, good thing we have our seatbelt on. <laughs> Wait a minute. Look up ahead. It looks like there are two really big hills. One, two. One of them looks really, really steep and really big. You think we can make it over it? <laughs> Good, me too. Okay, we're gonna go really fast and go over the big hill. <laughs> Let's do it. Here we go. Here we go. Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! That's pretty fun. <laughs> Whoa! It's really raining now, which means we get to have lots of fun in the rain and the mud. <laughs> Whoa! And look at what it is! It's an excavator! <laughs> yeah! Look, there's the cab where workers sit to control the boom, <laughs> the arm, and the bucket. Wait a minute, that's not the bucket. Those are seats. <laughs> you know what? I bet we can ride this excavator. Yeah, this isn't any ordinary excavator. This is Spin Dizzy. <laughs> and it's a ride. Yeah, it's called Spin Dizzy because you spin and get really dizzy. <laughs> okay, let's get on it. Woo, here we go. <laughs> Here we go! Woohoo! <laughs> okay. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Look at me go! Whoa! Woo! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! That was so fun! Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa! Did you see that? Whoa! That was so much fun spinning in the excavator! <laughs> I got a little bit dizzy. Whoa! That was so much fun today at Diggerland! <laughs> we saw so many construction vehicles and we got to operate them. <laughs> we even got to see an excavator. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> okay, <laughs> get ready. B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy, good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>Cochilla, Brazil. Wow, this place is awesome because they have so many cute animals that you actually get a pet. Maybe that's why they call it Pet Zoo. And today, you and I, we're gonna learn how to take care of animals. Are you ready? All right, let's go. <laughs> Whoa, did you see that? These two horses were scratching each other. Wait a second, they don't look like horses, do they? They do look like horses, but way smaller. Oh yeah, you're a pony, right? Yeah, these two ponies are actually sisters. Hey, you two are so cute, and they are so soft. Look at this one, this one is white, and this one is brown. Oh, do you two like me? Because I sure do like you. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Whoa, carrots. Interesting. <laughs> Do you like carrots? 
I do too. And I heard that these ponies love carrots. Shall we see if they're hungry? Oh, here you go. Whoa, are you hungry? Oh, whoa, they are hungry. Whoa, I guess ponies love carrots. Can you think of any other animal that loves carrots? Yeah, maybe one that likes to hop? Yeah, bunnies love carrots. Here you go. Here's some more. Oh, they are so nice to each other. I wonder if they like to play with each other. They definitely know how to scratch each other's backs. <laughs> here you go. Aww. <laughs> All right, here you go. Oh, and did you see this one? Yeah, look right here. Okay, let me turn it side right here. And do you see its hair? Yeah, its mane? Whoa, it's braided. Whoa, it's so cute. Oh, you don't have braided hair, but that's okay. Oh, you want food? Okay, here you go. <laughs> All right, well, let me set this right here and maybe I'll see you later. But if not, have a great day. Bye-bye. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Whoa, check it out. It's so pretty right here. Wait a second, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, photo shoot. <laughs> yeah, this place is awesome. Let's keep exploring. I think I see some more animals, come on. <laughs> Hello! Whoa! This is a llama! Hey, are you hungry? Because I think I see some food. Come on, come over here! Check it out! Yeah, a big white bucket of llama food! Whoa! Here you come. Here, you can come right over here. Whoa! Llamas are so cool! <laughs> yeah, they actually... Whoa! <laughs> Okay, patience. <laughs> okay, here you go. Do you see their food? Yeah, they love this stuff. It's so tasty. I'll hold out my hand nice and flat. Whoa, can you see its teeth? Here you go. Whoa, they're so crooked. <laughs> That's okay. Here you go. Is anyone else hungry? Oh, it looks like you have some friends. They don't look as hungry as you. Here you go. Wow, do you see this llama's ears? Very big ears. I bet it can hear very well. Oh, and did you know llamas can spit, but llamas actually do it in defense. Yeah, it's a defense mechanism. Yeah, if they ever get scared or anything like that, they can spit. Whoa, you are so cool. Whoa, and you're so soft. Oh, that was so much fun. All right, have a good day. Well, shall I keep exploring? Yeah, come on. Whoa, check it out. Now this is a giant bird. This is an ostrich. They're the biggest bird in the whole entire world. Whoa, hey. This, yeah, his name is Romeo. Wow, and he is so tall, even taller than me. And did you know ostriches' brains are so small, they're smaller than their eyes. Wow, they must not be very smart, right? Whoa, but they can run so fast. And did you know ostriches can't fly? Wow, who would have known? <laughs> wow, we'll see if Romeo is hungry, shall we? Check it out. Whoa, looks like we have some greeny leaves right here. Whoa, and then some pellets. Here you go. All right, Romeo, here you go. You want some pellets? Huh, maybe, here he comes. Okay, what about some green leaves? Here you go. Okay, here you go, Romeo. No, I guess Romeo's not hungry. <laughs> wow, they take care of their pets so well here. Yeah, a great way to take care of animals is to keep them nice and fed. And since Romeo's not hungry, someone must have fed him earlier. Oh, whoa, look, that ostrich was big. 
big. Now these birds are medium sized. Whoa, two of these are actually younger ostriches. And then two of these are emus. Yeah, yeah, it's a different type of bird. And they're medium sized. Whoa, they look so soft. I wish I could pet them. Whoa, is anyone hungry? No, no one's hungry again? Whoa, they're taken care of very well here. Whoa, all right, see you later. <laughs> Woo, Whoa, that was cool. Whoa, chickens. Wow, here you go. Hey, chickens. Hey, chickens. Here you go. Are you hungry? Yeah, these chickens look like they're very hungry. Whoa, what about you? Anyone else? Here you go. Whoa, I actually got special permission to go inside with these chickens. Okay, here, I'll be inside real soon, okay? <laughs> Here you go, birds. Wow, they are so cute. Who's hungry? Anyone hungry? Wow, chickens are so cool. Yeah, look at this one. This one is the color brown. And it sure does love this green leaf. Oh, hey, look at you, little cutie pie. Oh, this one's so small. And it's the color white. Here you go. Whoa, I love taking care of animals. <laughs> yeah, you make sure that they have a lot of water, a lot of food. Oh, whoa, and check that out. It looks like the chicken's home. This is called a chicken coop. I'm gonna go inside. <laughs> whoa, yeah, this is the chicken coop. Wow, they love to hang out in here. Oh, and look at this one, just relaxing. Yeah, I wonder if this one's sitting on some eggs. Hey, it's me, Blippi. Ooh, let me set these down right over here. Whoa, and we heard, yeah, that one of these is really nice. Maybe it will let me pick it up. There you go. Hey, cutie pie. Wow, look at it. Whoa, this is a small chicken. You are so cute. Whoa, do you see it has some red on its face? Yeah, and it's black and white. Okay, I'll set you down, okay? I hope you have a great day. <laughs> Whoa, here you go. Okay, see you later. Whoa, let me pick these up and let's keep exploring. Let's see what else we can find here. <laughs> Whoa, that was so much fun seeing that chicken coop. Yeah. Whoa, check it out. This doesn't look like a chicken coop. This actually looks like where humans live. Yeah, this is called a Powapiki. Yeah, this is a traditional Brazilian house. Whoa, I'm so curious to see what it's like. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa, it's so cool in here. Yeah, Powapiki? Yeah, that means clay and wood. Yeah, do you see this? It's made with clay and sticks, tree branches. Whoa, even maybe stumps too. Then you combine it all and it makes the house nice and strong. It is very nice in here. Wow, power peaky house. Wow, what a cool name and what a cool house. Yeah, you can do so much in here without electricity. Power peaky house music party. That was really fun. Oh, I should probably put these back where I found them. Whoa, hey, check it out. Yeah, this is the stove. How do you make heat if you don't have electricity? Fire, yeah, you can build a fire, which then you can say boil water and make some nice tea and have a tea party. Yum, <laughs> oh, and look at this. Wow, what a cool device. This you can use to make cheese. Whoa, cheese please. Whoa, it is so cool how people can make so much with no electricity. Whoa, well, shall I keep exploring the pet zoo? <laughs> Let's go. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. The 
this has been so much fun today. And do you see what that says? It says farmhouse. Yeah, let's see what lives inside this house. Whoa, whoa, check it out. It looks like we have some animals. Hey, and actually they left me some food to feed them. Whoa, this is gonna be nice. Speaking of nice, wow, what a great farmhouse. Okay, let me put this on. Oh, there we go, all right. Hey, whoa, did you see that? Yeah, it looked like a goat. Oh, maybe I can bring them out here so then you can see. Here they come, hey goats. Hey, it's me, Blippi. Are you hungry? Oh, there you go. Yum! Whoa! I should probably go inside, right? Whoa! Okay. They gave me special permission to be able to come inside here. Okay. Hey, goats! Whoa! How are you? Whoa, they are so cool! Yeah, it looks like there's whoa, so many! Whoa! Hey, here's one right here. Hey, are you hungry? Whoa, how are you? Oh, you are so cute. Yeah, it's the color white. Ooh, it has a little black on its head and brown. Oh, and they said this one actually likes to get picked up. Yeah? <laughs> you are so cute. This is a baby goat and it is so soft. And look how big its ears are. I bet they can hear very well. Oh, okay. I'll set you down nice and gently. Here you go. All right, see you later. Whoa, that farmhouse was so cool. I love taking care of all these animals. <laughs> whoa, speaking of animals, whoa, look at this. Yeah, hey, looks like a big cow, right? Whoa, <laughs> this is actually a bull. I know it's a bull because of its antlers. Wait a second, it doesn't have antlers, it has horns. Do you see that? The difference between antlers and horns are antlers fall off of the animal. But bulls, they have horns. These stay on the bull its whole life. Oh, are you hungry? Oh, he's so big. Here you go, you want some food? Whoa, oh, I felt his tongue. Oh, you are so cool. And do you see his teeth? Here you go. Whoa, whoa, hey, whoa, can I pet you? Oh, wow, his nose feels so nice. Whoa, what about your head? Oh, do you like pets? Yeah, some animals to take care of them. Yeah, you wanna pet them and love them. Ooh, and you can even brush them. Yeah, some animals like pets, some animals don't like pets. But this bull loves pets, right? Whoa! Or are you just hungry? Another way to take care of animals. Yeah! Give the animals some food. Whoa! Whoa! It's so slobbery. Every time I put my hand, yeah, for food, yeah. He licks it with his tongue and pulls it in. And it gets my hand all slobbery. <laughs> all right, see you later. It was fun taking care of you today. You are so cute. Oh, do you like the pets? Oh, are you wagging your tail? Are you cute? Okay, see you later. <laughs> oh, look right here. Yeah, remember earlier how I said you have to take care of the pens? Yeah, looks like someone took care of these pens, made sure it's nice and clean. <laughs> Whoa, hey, another animal. Whoa, ooh, this is a jumento. Here you go. Oh, are you hungry? Wow, doesn't it look like a donkey? Whoa, and the jumentos. Yeah, their cheese made from their milk is some of the most expensive cheese in the whole wide world. Okay, see you later. Yeah, I heard there's some real donkeys right over here. Wow, jumentos and donkeys, yeah, they're related to each other. But these, yeah, they're donkeys, hey. Whoa, are you too hungry? Hey, do you see how big its ears are? Oh, here you go. Oh, do you want a nice snack? What about pets? Do you like the pet? Did you see how I didn't love to get pet? Yeah, that's okay. 
<laughs> I don't have to pet you. Or maybe he's just pulling away because he's actually hungry. Yeah, sometimes they might actually really like pets. But right now, maybe this one just wants a bunch of food. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, yeah, and this one's the color brown. And this one is also the color brown. Hey, ooh, you have some white on your face. Ooh, and I actually heard, yeah, this donkey's name is Juka. Yeah, you know my good friend Juka? Whoa, you two have the same name. Ooh, Juka, you love pets, don't you? You do, you do, do you? <laughs> <laughs> and you also love food. Here you go. Wow, and their pen looks nice and clean. Wow, you are taken care of very well. I love taking care of animals. <laughs> All right, see you later, Yuka. Bye-bye. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Here at Pet Zoo, they even have a playground. Whoa, I do love playing. All right, first thing I should do is probably take off my shoes, right? Oh, will you count my shoes with me? Ready? <laughs> Here's one. All right. And two. One, two. I have two shoes. Okay, let me put it right in here in those cubbies. And now it's time to play. Whoa, look at this. Looks like you climb inside. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, it's pretty wobbly. Whoa, whoa, look at how high I am up here. A big blue slide. I love slides. Okay, here I come. Whoa, whoa. I got a little stuck. Not the fastest slide, but that's okay. It was still fun. Come on. Whoa, I should probably grab my shoes. But over here, there's another fun thing to do. Come on. Whoa, cool, a trampoline. Oh, and it's so colorful. Woohoo! yeah, I love trampolines. Hey, since we're learning about how to take care of animals today, why don't you guess which animal I'm thinking of? One that really likes to jump. Yeah, it can put its babies in its pouch right here. And you find a lot of them in Australia. Woohoo! Yeah! Look at me! I'm a kangaroo! Will you jump like a kangaroo with me? Woohoo! Yeah! Woo! Boing! 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 <laughs> okay, I have another animal for you to guess. Okay? A lot of them are green around the world, but here in Brazil, yeah! They're so colorful, and they're actually pretty poisonous. And the sound that these animals make is ribbit, ribbit. Yeah, a frog. And here in Brazil, they even have colorful poison dart frogs. Woohoo! Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Oh, frogs are so cool. I had so much fun today. Whoa, whoa, I should probably put on my shoes. I think I'm all done playing. All right, here's one shoe, and then here's two shoes. Wow, did you have fun with me? Yeah, I had fun with you too. I really enjoy taking care of animals, and I also love to play. Yeah, whoa, check it out, some water. I'm still super tired from playing. All that jumping and climbing, yeah, like animals. Oh, it's very important ah, to hydrate. Oh, today was so much fun taking care of all those animals. I sure do love animals, and it makes me so happy knowing that you love animals and you take care of all the animals. And if you have pets, you make sure that they're nice and healthy and happy. Oh. Mm. Well, this was so much fun. And if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Please spell my name with me. Ready? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. Good job. All right, see you again. This has been so much fun in Brazil. Bye-bye. <laughs> Whoa, hey.
Hi, it's me, Blippi. Hi, and I'm Mika. And look at where we're at. We're at Artists at Play. Yep, in Seattle, Washington. And this place is so cool. You can play like an artist. That's right. You can climb, you can dance, you can even make music. <laughs> that sounds like so much fun. Mm -hmm. Shall we? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Whoa! Wow. Cool! This looks like the yellow song fence. Whoa, a song fence? That sounds cool. I wonder how you do it. Whoa, look at these balls. Interesting. <laughs> Whoa, that sounds great. Yeah. And they sounded a little different. Yeah, let's hear it again. Oh. This one was higher than that one. Yeah, mine was a little lower. Wait a second. Let's widen out and see what that sounds like. Good idea. Ready? Yep. Oh, yeah. My side is higher pitch. Yeah, and my side is lower. Let's go even wider. Okay. Ready? Yep. Ooh, that was really low. <laughs> wow! This side is high and that side is low. Yeah. Wait a second. Since you're good at singing, let's check your pitch. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ready? Yep. Oh, yeah. Good job, Mika. <laughs> you're a great singer. Yeah, let's check your pitch. <laughs> okay. Let's go up here. <laughs> Ready? Yep. Oh. Not bad. <laughs> Close. <laughs> Wait. I have an idea. Why don't we start down there and go from really high? Wait, that side was low, yeah, right? Yeah, that's the low side. Okay, <laughs> go from really low down to up to really high. Yeah, we can hear all the notes. Come on. All right, ready? Yep. Here we go. <laughs> Inside. Oh, you're right. Wait, huh. what if we drop rocks on them? Try it. Oh. Whoa, what a fun way to make music. Oh, yeah, and there's some over here. Oh, wow, let's try it out. Oh, this one only has two, a big one and a small one. Yeah, I wonder if one will be high and one will be low. All right, let's try it out. All right, ready? Yep. Okay. Wow. Oh. Oh. So the small one made a high-pitched noise. Yeah, and this one, the bigger one, made a lower noise. <laughs> oh. Hey, I have an idea for a very, 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 very fun game. Oh, what is it? <laughs> okay, I will drop rocks on these two items. Uh -huh. And then if it's the high pitch, you jump high. Okay. And if it's the low pitch, you squat down real low. Awesome. Oh, will you play with me? Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Are you ready? Yep. I'm going to just use my ears and listen. Hey. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> yeah! I do! Really good! You got every single one right! Nice! You did a good job, too! Good job! <laughs> well, shall we? Yeah, let's keep looking! Oh, Mika, check it out! Oh, that looks like so much fun! Wow! This is a jungle gym, and it looks like it's made out of rope! Yeah, and you can climb up the rope, which is so cool! Yeah! Wait a second, why don't we climb up higher than where we're at right now? Yeah, and things will look differently up high! That sounds like fun! Let's, Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> is gonna be fun to see what we can see up here. Yeah, we could climb really high. Whoa, you're doing a great job. You too, Blippi. Oh, thank you. Whoa. Whoa, this is cool. We can see so much from up here. Yeah, we're really high up. We can see the whole playground. Oh yeah, there's the swings. Whoa, and Whoa. where we made some music. Yeah. Whoa. Hey, guess what I have. What? I brought my Telescope! Whoa! Cool! Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> you scared gotcha. me! Gotcha! <laughs> and check it out! The Space Needle! Whoa! It's so high up! Yeah! Hey! What? I wonder if we can get even higher, as high as the Space Needle! Oh yeah! If we go to the top of the Space Needle, I bet we're gonna see things differently from yeah. way up high! And probably see even more! Cool! Let's go! Okay! Whoa, Blippi, check it out. The elevator that will take you up 52 floors. Whoa, that's really high. I'm excited. I know, me too. <laughs> Wait a second. I have an idea. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah. A, a race. race. <laughs> I'll take the stairs. And I'll take the elevator. All right, and we'll see who wins. Yes, let's do it. Ready? Yep. Three, Three two, two, one, go. I can't believe I get to go to the very top of the Space Needle. I wonder if I'm going to be Blippi. This elevator's really fast. Did you know that the Space Needle is over 600 feet tall? That's more than 180 meters. Very, very tall. Whoa, we're so high up now. Oh, I think we're almost to the top. 830, 831. 832! Yeah! I made it to the top of the Space Needle! Oh, I am very tired though. Oh, that's a lot of steps. But wait a second, where's Mika? Hey, Blippi! Oh, hey, Mika! You made it to the top of the Space Needle! Yeah, I can't believe you got here first! Well, I am pretty fast. You are really fast! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Whoa! What a beautiful view! Yeah, come look! And it looks like there's a deck right here. Oh, this must be the observation deck. You are so smart, Mika. <laughs> Shall we go check it out? Yeah, let's do it. Whoa, Whoa this place is awesome. Yeah, check out this incredible view. Whoa, and do you see all that water? Oh, that's called the Elliott Bay. Oh, it is? Yep. <laughs> wow, I bet there's a lot of fish in there. Oh, I bet you're right. Oh, I see a lot of boats. Oh, and buildings and yeah. green trees. Oh, yeah, so pretty. Yeah. Did you know these trees are called evergreen trees? They stay green year round. So cool. Yeah. Some people call Seattle the Emerald City because of all of the green trees. Because emerald is green. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Mika, why is this place called the Space Needle? Hmm. It's not like we're up in space. <laughs> That's true. Well, in the World's Fair a really long time ago, it was space theme. So they built this tower that looks like something maybe you'd find in space, right? Oh yeah, it does. <laughs> yeah, Ooh. we're so high up. I feel like we are getting close to space. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> well, shall we keep exploring? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, this has been wow. so much fun. Yeah. Whoa, cool. Oh, there are Whoa. Whoa, what? Mika, watch out. Oh, you almost me. fell through. It's okay. It's a glass floor. <laughs> Whoa, are you sure it's safe and yep. strong? It's actually 10 layers of glass, which means it's as strong as walking on concrete. See? Whoa, be <laughs> careful. Totally Do you think safe. it's safe enough for me to come on too? Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, it feels kind of funny. You got this. Whoa. <laughs> All, right. Whoa. All right. There you go. All right. <laughs> 
See? Whoa! Yeah, yeah. I guess it is safe. <laughs> Whoa! This is really cool. I know, right? Oh, and look down there. Yeah, you can see all the way to the ground. Yeah, everything looks so small. Uh huh. Shall we lay down? Oh, good idea. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. Oh, wow, they look like ants, but they're actually people. Yeah, it's so teeny tiny. Whoa! Hello! Hey! <laughs> Wait a second. Mika, do you see what I see? We're moving. Whoa. Yeah. A rotating glass floor? Yeah, and it's the only rotating glass floor in the world. Whoa, cool. This is awesome. I know, it's really fun. Whoa. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and if it rotates and goes all the way around, we can stand right here and see the whole city 360 degrees. Oh, it's so cool. <laughs> yeah. Speaking oh. of cool, look at the view. Yeah. Look at all of those houses. Wow, that building is so big. Whoa, really big, <laughs> but not as tall as this tower. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, oh. and that's a big lake over there. Oh, yeah. What do you see? Oh, I see some traffic over there. Whoa. Oh, there's a football field. Whoa, cool, that looks like fun. Yeah. Oh, and speaking of fun, the playground we were on oh, earlier. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Oh. <laughs> hey. Hey, do you want to get a closer look? Uh, yeah, how do we do that? I brought binoculars. Whoa, cool, Mika. <laughs> yeah, you want to share? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, hello. Hi. <laughs> wow, let's look out there. Whoa. Whoa, look at that person. Oh. Cute oh. bag. Hello, sir. <laughs> oh, well, I wonder where he's going. Oh, in a big hurry, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look up here. <gasps> Whoa! Oh, a rainbow! It's so colorful! Yeah. Oh. oh, I love rainbows! Yeah, do you know how rainbows are made? Oh, tell us! Well, light shines through a bunch of water molecules, and then it creates a rainbow! Yeah, and they're so pretty! Wow, <laughs> this has been so much fun up here! Yeah, what a cool way to see the city! Yeah, let's go! <laughs> do you know what day it is? Rainbow day! It's rainbow day, yeah! Flippy, how you doing? Red and orange, yellow, green and blue, and indigo and violet. Do you like it? It's a colorful world, and we're all smiling. Look around you at all the happy faces. So much to see, so many different places. And all the birds are going tweet, tweet, tweet. And we're smiling at whoever we Day. It's so colorful. Oh, <laughs> that was so much fun! Yeah, I had a great day learning and playing with you, Blippi. Oh, me too, Mika. <laughs> wow, wasn't that so much fun playing at the Artists of Play? Yeah, we made such cool music with those sound machines. <laughs> oh, and it was really fun racing to the top of the Space Needle in Seattle. Yeah, Blippi, you were really fast. Well, it was really tiring. That's a lot of stairs. Yeah. I was <laughs> impressed. Yeah. It's 
speaking of impressed. Yeah, the view was incredible. <laughs> yeah, and this glass floor Whoa. was so awesome. Yeah, I love the Space Needle. <laughs> yeah, me too. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with us? Yeah. <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. -I. Blippi. Good job. Hey, will you spell my name with us? Cool. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> all right. See you again. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> Aloha! It's me, Blippi! And look at where I'm at today! Hawaii Volcanoes National Park on the big island of Hawaii! And this place is awesome because of volcanoes! Today, you and I are gonna learn about volcanoes. Yeah, maybe we'll find out what it looks like after it erupts, or maybe some lava tubes, Ooh, and maybe some steam! All right, are you ready to learn and have some fun? Me too! Let's go! Wow, this place is so cool. And I even have a map, but it's kind of confusing on where I'm at. I'm trying to find all those cool things like the lava tubes and the volcano. <laughs> Aloha, Blippi. Oh. Are you lost? Do you need help finding anything? Hey, whoa, are you a park ranger? I am a park ranger here. My name's Ranger Aaron. Wow, and yeah, to answer your question, I am lost. I was actually trying to find the lava tubes. Ooh, well, you're in luck. We have Nahuku Lava Tube right down this trail. Do you want to go see it? Yeah, will you show me? Yeah, let's go together. All right. Whoa, great. <laughs> Ranger Aaron, this place is beautiful. I know. I love this hike over here. I would call this a rainforest. We do have areas of rainforest here at Kilauea Volcano. Really? How did the eruption not get rid of all these plants? Well, the thing is, during many volcanic eruptions here, the lava doesn't cover the whole forest. It sometimes, it'll flow around areas and leave a little pocket of forest. We call these kipukas. Kipuka. That's right. These are really important, actually, because kipukas serve as seed banks. Seed banks? What are those? It means they're areas where all of the seeds from our native plants can be saved. And then after an eruption, the wind might blow them, birds might pick them up and drop them on the new lava, and new plants can start to grow. These plants make it possible for the rest of the forest to come back to that area. And eventually, you may not even know there was ever a lava flow there. Wow, that is really cool. But since there's a lot of poisonous gases in the air when volcanoes erupt, how do these plants survive? Well, a lot of our plants here on this island, they had to adapt to survive a volcano such as our Ohia Lehua tree. Look at these giant trees above us. Wow, they these, are big. <laughs> these trees are very important in Hawaiian culture, and they also have some superpowers to help them survive a volcanic eruption. Superpowers? I love superpowers. What do you mean? Well, the Ohia Lehua tree can actually hold its breath during a volcanic eruption for up to two weeks. Oh, that's a long time. Mm -hmm. wow, this is really cool. Can we keep exploring? Yeah, let's go see the lava tube. Oh, cool. Let's go. <laughs> wow, what's this? This is the Nahuku lava tube. Lava tube? What does that mean? Well, that means this is a tunnel where lava used to be flowing during an eruption. But sometimes at the end of the eruption, the lava will flow out and leave this empty tunnel behind. And this one we can actually walk through. Oh, cool. That sounds really exciting. Can we walk through it right now? Yeah, let's go. All right. <laughs> you lead the way. All right. <laughs> oh, pretty dark wow. in here. Yeah, don't worry. There are some lights. All right. <laughs> Whoa, cool. So we have to imagine this is where the lava used to be flowing through many, many years ago. Oh, wow. This is really cool. Oh, and it's getting pretty dark in here. I know. Good thing we've got a few lights to help us see the way. Oh, yeah. Smart. Oh, cool. Do you mind if I touch the wall? Oh, please don't. This is actually a very unique ecosystem in our park. There are some insects that live here that don't live anywhere else. And if we touch the walls, we could disturb this ecosystem. Okay, if you're ever in a lava tube, don't touch the walls. Whoa! And it's really cool how there's special insects that just live in here. But hey, what's that sound? Yeah, the dripping? Is it raining in here? 
Actually, volcanic rock is very porous. That means there's lots of little holes and cracks in it. So when it rains, the water can filter down through the rock and eventually it can drip right on top of us. Oh, cool. Well, I guess we'll continue, but we'll try and not get wet. <laughs> right, we should have brought an umbrella. Yeah. Wow, that was really cool. I know, this is one of my favorite places in our national park. Yeah, and you're so smart knowing about those insects and also how the water drops through the rock. Well, they're important facts to know to understand how special our volcano is. Yeah, it is very special. Hey, and speaking of volcano, do you mind if we go check it out? Yeah, do you want to go see Hale Ma'u Ma'u Crater? Oh, I would love to. That sounds like fun. All right, let's go see our volcano. All right. <laughs> wow, cool, a volcano. That's right. This is a very special place at the National Park. So whenever I bring students up here, I remind them to keep quiet voices oh. so that we can be respectful so that everybody can enjoy this part of the National Park. Wow, and why is it so sacred up here? Well, this is known as a vahipana. In Hawaiian, that means a sacred place. In Hawaiian culture, many people believe that this crater, Hale Ma'u Ma'u Crater, is the home of Pele Honuamea. Pele is the fire goddess and the goddess of volcanoes, and many people believe that the Hawaiian islands would not be here without Pele. So that's why this is such a sacred and special area in the park. Wow, this is a special place and it's so peaceful. But wait a second, what is a volcano? Well, a volcano is a geologic feature where underneath the Earth's crust, magma chambers can form. Magma is molten rock. So these pockets of molten rock start building up pressure. And eventually they can build up enough pressure that they actually break through the Earth's crust and lava can erupt out of the Earth's crust. Wow, cool. So does this volcano erupt a bunch of lava? It does. Actually, this volcano is erupting right now. Wait, right now? Why is it not just exploding in air? Well, the Hawaiian volcanoes don't usually have explosive eruptions. The Hawaiian volcanoes have what we call effusive eruptions. So the lava can bubble out and flow, and they also sometimes erupt out of rift zones in the side of the volcano. Oh, that makes sense. So is that the lava down there? Well, that is the lava down there. Once lava cools and turns into rock, it turns black. So we're looking at the cooled lava lake right now. Wow, and when did this eruption start? This current eruption started in September of 2021. Oh, and what did it look like before that time? Well, there was actually a really big change in our volcano before the last big eruption. Before that really big eruption, our volcano, the caldera, was more flat. And Hale Ma'u Ma'u Crater was very small. It would have just been right over there. But what happened during that eruption? We had that magma chamber underneath the earth and it started to empty because it was erupting out of the side of the volcano. Okay. So eventually all of the lava, all of the magma got out of that chamber and it was just empty. And when it was hollow and empty like that, it couldn't hold the weight of the volcano. So it actually collapsed. Wow. And that's what we can see here. This crater got much, much bigger during that eruption. Wow, that's really cool. So is this the only volcano that you folks have here? Flippy, guess how many volcanoes you can see right now? Um, one? The answer is actually three. We have five volcanoes on our island total, and we can see three of them right here. Do you want to go see the others? Yeah, let's go. All right, let's go. Whoa, so that's the other volcano we can see? Right, that is one of the other volcanoes we can see from right here. That's called Mauna Kea. And one interesting fact is Mauna Kea is so tall, in the wintertime, it can actually get snow. Wait, snow in Hawaii? That's right, I used to teach second grade, and my second graders could go to the top of Mauna Kea, sled down a hill with snow on it, and then go to the beach in the same day. <laughs> wow, that sounds like so much fun. I would love to live here. I love sledding and the beach. <laughs> oh, wait, so you said there's another volcano? All I see is hills. Well, actually, we are going to see Mauna Loa Volcano. And this is a really great example of why they're called shield volcanoes. You see this big hill behind us? Yeah. 
that is all Mauna Loa. That is all the volcano. Wow, even though it doesn't look like this, it looks like this, a shield volcano, it's still a volcano. That's right, like a superhero shield laid on its side. <laughs> cool. Wow, do you have any other fun things to see today? Do you want to see some steam vents with steam coming out of the earth? Yeah, I'd love to. All right, let's go see those last. All right. <laughs> Wow, this place is awesome. Yeah. Park Ranger Aaron, what is this? This is a steam vent. Oh, a steam vent? What's that? Well, do you remember when we walked through the lava tube, we felt all of those drops of water falling on us? Yeah. Well, something similar happens here. Remember, our, our volcanic rock is so porous. That means there's lots of holes and cracks in it. Right. So when it rains, the rainwater can seep down through the rocks. Okay. Do you remember what's underneath a volcano? Uh, the magma chamber? That's right, all of that <laughs> magma, that super hot molten rock is underneath our volcano. So eventually the water seeps down so far, it gets heated up by the magma, it evaporates and it turns into steam. Wow. The steam can escape from these cracks in the earth just like this. Wow, this has been so much fun learning about volcanoes with you today. You're so knowledgeable. Well, thank you for coming and learning about volcanoes. It's so important that we work together to protect these special places. Awesome, thank you. <laughs> well, I've got to go meet some youth junior rangers over at the visitor center. Wow, cool. All right, bye, Blippi. All right, see you later. Enjoy your visit. All right, have a good day. Wow, Mount Aloha looks so big. And remember how we learned that it looks like a superhero shield laying down flat? Yeah, not all volcanoes look like this. Wow, we learned so much today. We even got to walk through a lava tube and it was so tubular. <laughs> yeah, and those steam vents, so cool. And it was pretty warm too, that steam from all that heat. Wow, and that crater, it was so big and vast. Wow, I sure did love learning about volcanoes with you. But this is the end of this video. If you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. Good job, all right, see you again, Bye bye It's me, Flippy! And today, we're here at Up Flying Yoga in Los Angeles, California! <laughs> Whoa! And check it out! We're so high up in the sky! <laughs> Look! You can see the mountains and trees, even buildings! <laughs> well, I am so excited because you and I get to have fun doing aerial arts! <laughs> yeah! Aerial means up in the air. <laughs> and we're gonna have lots of fun up in the air together. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. <laughs> I'm swinging in this hammock. <laughs> yeah, normally you might wanna take a nap in a hammock, but this one is great for swinging in, climbing on, and spinning. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, that's because this is an aerial hammock. Yeah, <laughs> you can do all kinds of things on it. Whoa, <laughs> it sure is fun. <laughs> oh, but if you're doing anything with aerial silks or aerial hammocks, you wanna make sure there's a grown up nearby so you stay nice and safe. <laughs> okay, let's swing. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Look at me go. <laughs> Whoa, hello. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah, you can swing sitting down or you can swing standing up. Woo! <laughs> Here we go. Woo! <laughs> Look at me go! <laughs> Whoa! I'm up so high! Hello! <laughs> Woo! I'm a bird! Hello! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> well, that's pretty silly. <laughs> but I think I want to spin some more. Here we go. Whoa, check it out. It's an aerial cube. <laughs> Ooh, I bet we can climb up in this. Here we go. Whoa, look. <laughs> oh, so relaxing in the cube. <laughs> yeah. Hey, do you know what a cube is? A 
a cube is kind of like a square. Yeah, kind of like a square, but it's 3D. Whoa! And every side is the same size. Yeah, all six sides, whoa, are the same. <laughs> Check it out. Whoa! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> this is kind of tricky. Woo! Whoa! Yeah, look. If you see it from this angle, it looks like a diamond. But I bet... Now, it kind of looks like a square. Woo! Yeah, a square! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Woo! Okay, <laughs> I should probably get down from here. Okay, here we go. Woo! <laughs> well, that was pretty fun, but I think I need a teacher to help me out a little bit. <laughs> it would probably make it a lot more fun and I could probably do some cool new things. <laughs> hmm, let's go find someone to give us some tips. Check it out! It's an aerial instructor! <laughs> Whoa, she's really good at this! <laughs> oh, maybe she can teach us! <laughs> Let's go ask! <laughs> Hi, I'm Blippi! What's your name? Whoa! Hi, Blippi! <laughs> <laughs> I'm Kimberly. Oh, it's nice to meet you, nice Kimberly! To meet you. <laughs> Whoa, you're really good at aerials! Thank you! Whoa! Ooh, well, we were doing some climbing and some spinning <laughs> and some swinging, but do you think you could help us? Uh, can you dance? Oh, I love to dance. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I love to dance. Perfect. Let's do some aerial dance then. Aerial dance? Oh, you mean we can dance, but in the air? That's exactly it. <laughs> yeah, I would love to. All okay. right, grab for your hammock. Okay, here we go. Whoa, <laughs> look at this hammock. It's so big and purple. <laughs> it's like a sail. Yeah, whoa. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> okay. I have the hammock. Grab for one edge. Bring your thumbs inside. Okay. Fingers, all four of them on each hand. On the outside, slide your hands outside of your hips. Okay. Reach for six handfuls. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Bring those elbows in, shoulders in. Ooh, okay. Press your fingertips towards the ground. Jump up inside. Whoa, <laughs> check it out. Ooh, we made it in the hammock. Hands up high towards the sky, all the way around the outside of the back. Grab it like a rope on each side. You can walk your legs forward so you're sitting on the very edge of this little ledge. Ooh, nice. And then slide your hands down so you've got it on both sides, just like you'd wear a belt. Ooh, here we go. Good job. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go upside down. Are you ready? We get to go upside down? <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. You're gonna take your legs wide, keep your hands still, and then bring your feet together all the way around the front. Okay, here we go. Upside down, blippy, woohoo! Whoa! Whoa. And then take your right foot and your left foot all the way around the outside of the purple fabric Ooh. to the front. Okay. Good job. Whoa. You look fun. good. Yeah. <laughs> thumbs up. Thumbs up. Wait, thumbs down. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> okay. You want to go for a spin? Yeah. Let's do it. Time to spin. <laughs> Don't want to get too dizzy. <laughs> oh, so what should we do next? You want to do a handstand? Yeah. All right. Your fingers come on the floor directly under your shoulders. Tuck your chin to your chest. Look at those toes. Flex your feet. Straighten out your legs. Now straighten out your hands. Whoa. Feet towards the sky even more. Handstand. Yeah. Check it out. Whoa, that was fun. You want to do a no-hand handstand? A no-hand handstand? Sure. All right. Straighten out the legs. Straighten out the arms. Okay. Hands off. Whoa. Check it out. No hands. How stretchy are you? Can you reach to your toes? Reach for those toes. Yeah. Bend your knees. And lift up. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, we're up so high! But I do have one question. Kimberly, how do we get down? Oh, well that's even more fun. You're gonna reach for both hands on one fabric. Okay. All right, keep that left knee bent. Reach the right toes towards the floor. Come forward. Yes. And slide those hands down. Bend your right knee. Grab a hold of your right hand with your right foot. Ta-da! Ta-da! Hit and drop. Whoa, this is awesome! <laughs> Whoa, check it out! Look at these! <laughs> Whoa, they kind of look like a hammock, but there's not a place to sit. What are these called? 
This is called an aerial silk. It's like a hammock upside down. Whoa, an upside down hammock? <laughs> That's fun. Well, how do we play with these? You want to try to climb it? Yeah, that would be great. Okay. You're going to grab a hold of it. Okay. Yep. <laughs> and I want you to kind of hug the fabric with your legs. So your right leg comes up. Okay. Turn around, give it a giant hug, and flex the foot. Okay. You're going to slide the fabric underneath the toes. Oh, okay. And then you're going to reach your other foot onto the fabric and kind of hook it like you're crisscrossing. Great. So I Criss pull on the one fabric. Toe to the other. Yep. Like that. Awesome. It gets easier if you use both hammocks or uh, both silks. Do you want to try it together? Yeah. Okay. We'll try both silks. See if I can climb to the top. Okay. Okay. So bring them together. Give it like a giant little bear hug. Your uh, leg. <laughs> okay. Now we take our leg around. That's right. Like this. Yep. Flex our foot. Bring it as high as you can. Even higher. Woo. Even higher. Woo. Good job. And then up we go. <laughs> Woo. You can go higher. Okay. Whoa! Look how high I am! All the way to the top, Lippy. Good job! Whoa! I made it to the top! Whoa! Look at how high we are! Everything looks amazing from up here. Okay, I think it's time to come down. Nice and slowly. You're gonna squeeze your legs together and walk your hands down. Work with your legs, not with your hands. Whoa! Here I go! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> We made it! Good job! Yeah. Nice landing. Whoa, that was amazing. Oh, you've taught us so many amazing dance moves and how to climb a silk. <laughs> Thank you so much for teaching us today, Kimberly. You're welcome. Uh, well, I'll see you soon. I think I have all these tools. Now I can do my very own aerial blippy dance. Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> it's time for some blippy dancing. <laughs> yeah. Kimberly was so helpful and taught us all kinds of dance moves. And now we can take those dance moves and make blippy choreography. Oh, that's kind of a big word, choreography. <laughs> Have you heard that word before? Well, it's just a big fancy word for lots of dance moves put together. <laughs> we can do that. Time to dance. such a great day with you today, learning all about aerial arts. <laughs> and we even got to dance to our very own aerial blippy dance. Woohoo! <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> great. OK, here we go. B-L-I. P-P-I, Philippi. Good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Woo! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Hey, it's me, Blippi. Whoa! And look at where we're at. Yeah, today we're at Aquarium of Boise in Boise, Idaho. And this place is awesome. Yeah, it's an aquarium. Have you ever been to an aquarium before? Yeah, it's so cool because they have so many marine animals here. Yeah, marine animals are animals that live in the water. Well, shall we go explore? Let's go. Whoa. Oh, there's so many different kinds of fish in here. Whoa, they're all back there. Oh, hello. <laughs> Whoa, look up here. Looks like a list of different types of fish. Oh, look at that one. That one's called a yellow tang. Yeah, and it's all yellow. <laughs> I wonder why it's called yellow tang. <laughs> Ooh, and look at this one. It says purple tang. Ooh, looks like it's purple and yellow. Whoa, ooh, and that one way over there. Whoa, powder blue tang. Whoa, yeah, it's blue and yellow. 
Okay, let's try and find them. Um, let's find the yellow tang. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty distinct looking, huh? All yellow. Okay, not that one. <gasps> Wait, there's one way over there. Do you see it? It's so far back there. Oh, it's hiding. Hello, yellow tang. <laughs> Look up there. Yeah, an orange, white, and black fish. <gasps> I know what that is. Look up here. Yeah, that's the fish. It's a clownfish. Look up there. Do you see that blue fish? Yeah, it's just pure blue. It's really bright and vibrant. And look up here. Whoa, it's a blue damselfish. It's so bright and blue and colorful. Cool. See you later, fish. <laughs> Whoa, more fish. <laughs> Whoa, look at this in here. Wait a second. This looks like the same shape as the last clownfish, but this one is just black and white. Yeah, do you see it right there? Yeah, a black and white striped fish. Here comes another one. Wait, yeah, this is actually a type of clownfish. Yeah, but can you think of an animal that lives on land? That's black and white stripes? Yeah, a zebra. Wow, cool. These are the zebras of the ocean. <laughs> see you later, clownfish. Whoa, did you see that? Yeah, that looked like a puffer fish to me. Whoa, actually, it's a porcupine puffer. Yeah, looks really smooth right now. But if it gets frightened or scared or angry, what it does is its cheeks puff out and its whole body, yeah, becomes spiky. Yeah, it's a defense mechanism. Super cool. <laughs> Whoa, and look down here. Whoa, do you see this? Wow, looks like an eel. Yeah, this is actually a yellowhead moray eel. And it's just hanging out in the rocks. Yeah, just chilling. Yeah, that's what eels like to do. Hang out in the rocks and just poke their heads out. <laughs> All right, see you later. Fun hanging out with you. <laughs> Whoa, what else do they have here? <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Looks like an old boat that then water got into and rocks over the years. Whoa, it's a perfect fish habitat. Oh, and look at what I have. <laughs> yeah, some snacks for the fish. Yeah, just like how you and I like snacks. Yeah, fish like snacks too. Whoa, and they said I can actually feed these fish. All right, first, let's try these peas. There we go. <laughs> All right, pour it in my hand. And then we'll see if the fish like to come and eat some food. Here you go. Whoa, do you see all those fish? Yeah, those are Japanese koi fish. There's so many of them and they're so colorful. All right, we have a little bit more food over here. All right, hello, Japanese koi fish. Yeah. All right, here you go. Whoa, are you hungry? Oh, they're so cool looking. They're so colorful. Yeah, some are orange and black, some are white and black, and some are white, black, and orange. Oh, see you later. <laughs> All right, what else is around here? Whoa, look at this tank. This tank is massive. Looks like the fish are all on the other side. Oh, but there's a lot of gallons and liters of water in here. Oh, oh, and look at this. Whoa, looks like a scuba diver. Whoa, do you see this helmet? It looks like a port right here. Yeah, scuba divers have this area so then they can see while they're underwater. Ooh, and scuba divers wear this outfit so then they can stay warm under the water and so they can breathe underwater. You know how you and I have to hold our breath underwater? Scuba divers can breathe while they're underwater. Cool. Ooh, and do you see this big weight? Yeah, us humans, we tend to float. So this weight is holding the scuba diver on the bottom of the sea floor. So then this scuba diver can work. Yeah, looks like the scuba diver works underwater. 
Wow! Whoa! Look at all these tanks! Wow, this is so cool! Woo! And look at this one! It's really big and bright and vibrant! Yeah! Do you see that? Yeah, that orange thing? That is actually a sea anemone! Whoa! And do you see those rock looking things up there? Yeah, they're also pretty bright. Those are coral! Yeah, sea anemones and coral. Yeah, they're actually animals. They kind of just look like rocks, huh? Those coral do? <laughs> well, hey, do you see how bright they are and just vibrant in color? Yeah, it's actually because there's algae that lives inside the sea anemone. <laughs> Isn't that interesting? Whoa, oh look, you see how that fish is just hanging out with that sea anemone and right next to all that coral? Yeah, coral is actually really, really important because a bunch of fish like these ones actually live in all the coral. Yeah, it's just like how you and I live in a house. Yeah, these fish love to live inside the coral. Oh, and around the coral and use sea anemones as a nice soft bed. <laughs> so cozy. Whoa, oh, and look at this one. Oh, it's really bright and green. Whoa, so cool. Hey, remember how we saw that eel hanging out in the rock and the coral? Yeah, they're just hanging out in their homes. <laughs> See you later, enjoy your homes. <laughs> Look over here. Wow, this is a big tank. Whoa, do you see that fish way over there? Whoa, yeah, there's a fish way back there. It's so big. It's a bumblebee grouper. Yeah, and actually they live to be 80 to 100 years old. But this one's only about 10 years old, so it's gonna get way bigger. Whoa! Whoa, these are some big fish in here. Whoa! Look at these! Hello! Hey! And look at the bottom! Whoa! Do you see all those? Yeah, they definitely look like sharks, huh? <laughs> look at them just hanging out out the bottom. Whoa! Whoa, look at these fish. More big fish. Yeah, these are Paku. Yeah, Pakus to be exact, because there's many of them. Whoa, and they kind of look like really big piranhas. Yeah, and actually they eat vegetables. They're herbivores. Yeah, you see how big they are? Whoa, and actually let me show you something right up here. It's really cool. Yeah, here's the teeth. Do you see this? Yeah, they kind of look like human teeth that they have, huh? Whoa! And I have a big treat for us. Yeah, these Pakus, I bet, are very hungry and we have a nice yummy snack for them. Yeah, these are almonds. Watch out, they might splash. Whoa! Look at them go! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! I'm throwing them down so then they hear and see them splash. There we go. Yeah, it's like they're falling off of trees. Whoa, here you go. Whoa, they must be really hungry. Let me do a few at the same time. Whoa! Whoa, don't worry everyone. There's more for everyone. Here you go. Whoa, cool! <laughs> Whoa! All right, here's some more. <laughs> wow! Aren't they cool? They must be very, very hungry. Whoa, cool! <laughs> wow! Wasn't this so much fun learning about marine animals together? Yeah! I had a great time learning with you! <laughs> Well, this is the end of this video though, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. Good job. All right, see you again. <laughs>